वेलकम बैक फ्रेंड वेलकम टू मूडल ट्यूटोरियल फॉर डेवलपर सीरीज इन दिस वीडियो वी विल सी द कंटिन्यूशन ऑफ लास्ट वीडियो फ्रॉम वेयर वी लेफ्ट ओके सो ना सो इन लास्ट वीडियो यू आर एबल टू अपलोड द फाइल्स ओके नाउ दिस पाथ आल्सो कैन बी इंसर्टेड इन टू द database table so that you can you can say ki in this form submit which file i have uploaded okay so let's do that so the if you print this variable we will get the complete path so let's print now let's check what is coming Okay, so click on save changes. So you can see this path is coming. So let's try to put this this path, whatever the path is coming here into the DB. So here I am using the same table as we use in all our previous video. Okay, so I have added. You can see one field name that is called path file path. and that is a wire cut data type and the length is 500 okay and default value is null here so let's use this variable to insert the this file path okay so directly you can assign this okay so so this is just a variable you am assigning this in so i will use this file path okay so this one so this should work so let's check the behavior whether it is working or not so let's comment out this i think let's put a email so let's suppose ram at the rate of mail dot com and this file here let's make it another name let's change the name demo2 and uploading this one okay click on save changes so you can see here the demo2 your file has been uploaded and in the db record let's refresh here you can see in the file path this value is appearing okay now there may be a possibility that the file you are uploading here is already exist then in this case moodle provide the option whether you want to replace or just ignore so let's come here on the definition of this save file function okay so right click and go to definition so ideally this will be inside the forms lib lib forms lib so override means false or true value will come here okay so if you want if, if value is already sorry the file is already there in the path then override then what you need to put here just true okay so let's see here let me refreshing you can see this is uploaded on 10 3 pm okay so let's upload the same file again okay this file uploaded and you can see the time has been changed to 105 okay So now this one you can see the 954 uploaded. Now let's make a correction, make it false. And try uploading that file sample. Okay, so let's check here. Yeah. Oops, something went wrong. What does that mean? That means the file not uploaded. Okay. 
so this this is all you can use this third variable 